Hello, Jim Howard here in Fort Worth, Texas. Today's date, it is September 27th of 2019. I believe it's Friday. Yes, it's Friday. I think you can tell that I just have my one monitor on the desk. That's the 4K monitor, but... Oh, and I do have it in 4K mode, don't I? Yeah. Uh, you can also see that I have the uh, desktop software for uh, Logitech. You can see this is the mouse that I'm using. You know, it's a, like a gaming mouse or whatever. It has a, several different buttons, and I just use it in regular mode. Then I have this gaming keyboard, I guess, the uh, Logitech G910. I really like it. I like it because of the lighting. Uh, I like it because it has the scroll bar here for volume. And in fact, I, I don't want a keyboard that does. I have s several keyboards and nice, nice ones, but I know one of them doesn't have it, you know, so. So this is my uh, keyboard. And then this is my new, got it yesterday, uh, headset. And it's really for the microphone that I'm using. And I made a video yesterday with it when I was setting it up. And I didn't try adjusting anything. I just picked some of the presets. Um, and I don't get a lot of traffic to uh, my site. But uh, so I don't get a lot of comments. But uh, had two of the regular people say they didn't like the sound at all. But now I, I hadn't adjusted it at all um, yesterday, and I was just hitting the uh, the way it came and showing some of the different voices. And uh, so I looked at it since I had a couple of complaints saying, hey, the other headset was better. Uh, so I have adjusted a little bit, and one thing I did is I took off the high-pass filter. I'm not sure if that's the problem, but I listened, and I recorded. You can do a mic test. I listened, and what I was hearing was, you know, my voice, and then it drops, it would drop down occasionally, which it shouldn't be, which it shouldn't be doing. Um, also, I turned down the mic level and the output level a little bit. And today I'm not seeing any red. I'm seeing orange up there, but I'm not seeing any red. Let me see if I can speak really loud to get the red bar to show up at the top up here. Testing. No, it didn't. So I'm hoping maybe that that has taken care of the uh, taken care of the problem. So um, let me just do a general little blog here a little bit. Um, the new season of television shows has started here in the United States. And last night I watched uh, Sheldon, the break-off, the spin-off from the Big Bang Theory of Sheldon as a 10-year-old boy. I thought the show was really, well, I watched the other seasons of it. I thought it was really cute. And uh, Sheldon and his twin sister have just do a remarkable job 
all of the people in there do uh, a fantastic job. Uh, and I thought the show was really good. And I, so I watched the uh, season, first show of the season last night. We pay for CBS TV online. And uh, my ex-wife who and my grown son, we all share this apartment. Here's young Sheldon. Uh, she likes the game shows. And by having CBS online, she gets to, you know, watch them and the old ones and whatever. So uh, my ex-wife does not like comedy at all. And uh, if I happen to mention a special, you know, comedy thing and say, man, uh, Chappelle was really great. He made this thing or whatever. She always, you know, I, she always says, I don't like comedy. I don't like, you know, stand-up comedy. I don't like situational comedy. So, and she has to say it every time if I say, oh, well, Young Sheldon, that starts tonight. She said, I don't like comedy. So, you know, we don't have too much to talk about. And she just kind of, now for the first time, she's never voted in her life. And the current situation has made her complain and why doesn't somebody do something and uh, what else, you know, whatever. But uh, so politics, we can accept she gets really frustrated and it's like, why don't they do something? And, you know, and doing things takes time. There's a, she see, shows you watch. I don't watch. Let's make a deal. The price is right. Uh, that's a problem with, you know, we get, we cut the cable with uh, cable television because they were charging like, <clears throat> well, before, before she moved in here, she was paying like $150. And of course, I cut the cable much sooner than she did. But there for a while, I was paying <clears throat> almost that much. And uh, I'm not even going to add up, though, how much we spend for, you know, CBS Live, Netflix Prime, Hulu, I don't know who else. If I added those up, they'd probably, uh, anyway, um, recommend it for me. I did watch The Neighborhood, some past episodes. I stopped watching, uh, you know, it's black man and his family have a white neighbor move in. Okay, they, I forget, a season or two of it, and I, I think they've used everything up that they can. I mean, you know, it's, at some point it's supposed to be like, you know, black man is hostile to having this white neighbor and uh, but then they find things that they are the same between them and whatever so at some point that premise kind of stops you can't just keep doing season after season upset because you have a neighbor or something like that so I don't know what these other things are Um, haven't watched any of these. Don't know what they are. This evil, I saw like a preview, pre preview, <laughs> premiere or a thing. It might be, if that's the one I'm thinking of, it looks a little bit interesting. Now this Carol's second act, I saw again a little uh, clip of that. This is season one episode one which was yesterday and it might be okay i don't know might not 
and the unicorn one here, which was also yesterday. It just doesn't look, it just doesn't look good, but I might be mistaken. I didn't watch it, but, you know, man has his wife die, and he's going to get into the dating game or something or other, and, uh, of course, here's the episode from last night of Young Sheldon. I guess the name's Young Sheldon of the show. Uh, let's see. Whoops. What else do we have? I was, you know, a big Star Trek fan, but I just, I think, I think I've kind of given up on them. I think this this ended Super Donuts or Superior Donuts, and it was actually okay. Not great, but it was okay. Jewish man, I think black neighborhood. Uh, eventually, you know, hires in finally a young black man to help him with the thing, and it was okay. Not great, but okay. Oh. Uh, Every, these are old shows, you know. Everybody, of course, Cheers was great. I watched all those episodes. Everybody Hates Chris. Uh, it was really, really good. I really never watched, I mean, I might have watched one or two accidentally. Nothing else was on it. Family Ties. Of course, back in the old days, early TV, we, you know, you didn't have any choice. You had to watch uh, I Love Lucy. Taxi was great. Uh, Wings, I just watched a few of them, and they were good, but for some reason I didn't uh, watch any more. I don't know why. It just didn't grab me. But I've got a friend who just absolutely loved Wings, and uh, uh, belonged to a group that discussed it and all types of stuff. Uh, let's see. You know, you would think I would, like, I loved, um, uh, what was the old, or the cop TV show that was so good? Blue, whatever it was, that was great. And I, I you'd think, but I tried, I watched half of the first episode. Uh, of Blue Bloods, and I, it just turned me off. Uh, I don't know why, something about, you know, commanding officers or uh, people with authority and uh, just something. I never watched whatever this is, uh, never watched The Good Wife, never watched SWAT. Uh, Madam Secretary. I actually, I think that would be great. I just never watched it. And I've never watched any episode of NCIS. And I think it's because back in, you know, real life, back in uh We know that they did some, you know, that uh, the real NCIS did some investigations and they were totally incompetent in real life, criminally incompetent. Uh, and so I just, uh, I just can't get into watching it. Uh, let's see. Never watched the new Hawaii Five O. Man, I did not realize they had so many NCIS, you know, break-offs. Don't know what. I have never watched Beauty and the Beast in my life. You know, none of the things. 
I don't know, somebody that's a beast running around with a mask on or something, and I uh, just... CSI is something, too, I've, I've never really watched. Um, but man, all the spinoff shows they've had. Don't know what these are. Of course, Gunsmoke in the old days, watch those. Back in the old days, you didn't have much choice. You might have had three TV channels, you know. And so you had like, you know, at night or whatever, what, what are you going to watch? Let's see. Well, I guess the ex-wife, you know, I complain that if I mention a comedy, she says, I'm not into comedy. I don't like comedy. I've never found a comedy I've liked. I've never laughed or whatever. I really do not like game shows at all. So, And she loves them. Just loves them. Uh, let's see. don't even know what these are. Let's see. Classics. Of course, I watched in the old days the Brady Bunch. Never watched Seventh Heaven. Oh, loved Cheers. Fraser, I came to it late, but uh, yeah, I think after all, I think after it was already done and there was just reruns, but. And I never really watched Family Ties. I think I watched a couple episodes, and I, I thought it was pretty good. But uh, Taxi, of course, was great. I think I'm repeating myself now. Okay. Well, I guess I gave this microphone a, I hope, when I upload this video that, because, by the way, my hearing is not good, really bad, and I'm lucky that I was able to make it through my jobs. I always worked. A lot of times I had two jobs, and it affected my jobs but I managed to work around you know work around it and uh, so what else I'm, I'm gonna pop up but we're not gonna talk about it just want to see what the headline news is but I am not going to talk about it. I don't think... Uh, I don't think you want to hear about it, and I don't even want to think about it. So... A lot of times I show like the CNN front page just so if you're watching you know one of my videos and I've got videos starting in 2005 when uh, YouTube first began you, you can get a little bit of an idea I said I wasn't going to talk about it. I'm going to after I'm off here, I'm going to click on the skydiver dies, dies after crashing into a big rig trailer on highway. I got to check that out to see if the skydiver is coming down and, and, a, and a truck is moving down the highway, a 18 wheeler or whatever, and he hits it. I mean, I don't want to see the video, but. Uh, I, I wouldn't have the you know the guts to uh, at amusement parks. I don't even go and ride the, I'll take the merry-go-round and uh, 
maybe a tilty thing or something, but I don't go on the roller, I've never been on a roller coaster. I am not adventurous when it comes to that. So, anyway, thank you. Let's see, we're going to find out about the audio, I guess. Thank you very much for watching.